directly behind the candidate. Glenn Beck now talking about that. Have you heard this story the yet? The father of that Orlando murderer. Have you seen this story anywhere? It happened yesterday. Sitting behind Hillary at one of her uh, political the rallies. The so in the bag for Hillary Clinton, and it's expected. It's expected. And the media didn't make a big deal of it. If it wasn't for talk radio on the internet, you wouldn't know this stuff. And local news. Local news is still reporting actual stories. Finally asked if he thought some people would be surprised to see him there. Uh, he said, why should they be surprised? I love the United States. I've been living here a long time. Well, okay, for a couple of reasons. You did run for the presidency of Afghanistan. Hate to point it out yet again. You have made an anti-American video after your son shot Americans. Oh, and by the way, you've made pro-Taliban videos. Oh, and by the way, she is a presidential candidate. And no one, no one is doing any kind of vetting. The Secret Service, they're not knowing who's sitting directly behind. I mean, obviously, it's a terrible, it's terrible optics, as we would say. Terrible, terrible PR. PR ridiculous mistake for the campaign to make, but bigger than that, this is a presidential candidate. Who, well, I mean, uh, you're letting the person who, who is, as you said, ran for president of Afghanistan on a pro-Taliban flank, uh, who, who, who's a son of war, by the way, people, what? We're at war 